Now what is your uh, practice yoga and all? Can you share your experience about it? Oh yeah, I think uh, this is again a, again deep uh, gratitude to. Um, I had this longing to uh, study under the Sri Pikrishna Macharya tradition for a very very long time. Mm-hmm. And that's one more thing I noticed about spirituality. I think good uh, just to kind of bring alive my experience mm-hmm. that don't uh, what to say don't be afraid of having intentions and dreams. Mm-hmm. But for me, don't don't ask when, how mm-hmm. and what. Mm-hmm. That is not in my hand. Mm-hmm. But yes, sowing the seed of my dreams, sowing the seed of my intention. Yes, it is in my hand. Mm-hmm. But not asking when it will sprout. It's mm-hmm. just like sowing seeds on the ground, right? Right, right? I don't determine the flower has to be this shape or that shape or the that leaf has to be this shape. Mm-hmm. But I show up and sow the seed. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I the seed can serve multiple generations. The mm-hmm. so, wohi that is the second biggest learning for me. Mm-hmm. Let go of the outcomes or the way I want the outcome to happen. Very mm-hmm. difficult, very easy to say. Mm-hmm. The most difficult to practice. Mm-hmm. But I think I begin to experience that. Mm-hmm. That mujhe. Meko, I don't have to withdraw from life. Mm-hmm. In even let's say having a materialistic dream. Mm-hmm. Artha kama dono important hai. Mm-hmm. I don't have to back off from life. Yeah. I have to show for the artha and kama to, the way it is responsible and appropriate for me in this lifetime. Mm-hmm. But I can't say the mm-hmm. artha kama ko aisa hi pull na chahiye. Mm-hmm. That is another lesson of spirituality which I want to offer to the viewers from my experience. Mm-hmm. Now coming back to yoga, so yes, I made the intention to study under the tradition about. About about now seven years now, mm. way back in I was living in the UK, mm. and this was in Cambridge, and I met a yoga teacher who was deeply influenced by uh, Sri Sri Varsha Ramaswami, mm-hmm. one of the, one of the, one of the students of Krishna Macharya, mm-hmm. and that was the time uh, along with Sri Rav Sri Varsha Ramaswami got encountered with the teachings of Desi Kachar Sir, Krishna Macharya Sir, and uh, and and A G Mohan, mm-hmm. and that was the time it I deep and what really touched me was why the intention came up was. The whole tradition hinges on the uniqueness of each individual. Mm-hmm. It is not changing the individual to the practice, mm-hmm. but adapting the practice to the individual, mm-hmm. and that really pierced my heart. Mm-hmm. But that is that is my struggle of life at that point of time and now, right? Mm-hmm. How do I truly, truly accept me as a unique human being? Mm-hmm. It's very different from the US, Ganesh, and all the all the million subscribers and million audiences out there, right? Yeah, yeah. Because I could come here, how? How can I really truly accept myself for who I am? Mm-hmm. मैं ऐसा ही हूँ. Mm-hmm. मैं ऐसा ही बदलता रहता हूँ. मेरे ऐसे ही हालात हैं. मैं जितना खुद को मैं वो प्यार कर सकूँ. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So so that was when so when I read that tradition and its principles and philosophy, I truly longed to study. Mm-hmm. But only last year had uh, seven years hence I had the grace of uh, being enrolled and student at the at the one and a half years. Um, Uh, teacher training program, mm-hmm. an exhaustive program, it's an eight hundred hour course, and what has really touched me the last uh, six eight months among all my teachers and mentors at at Krishna Chandra Yoga Mandir, I'm deeply mm-hmm. grateful and I bow to them. Mm-hmm. Uh, is to is to encounter the Yoga Sutras mm-hmm. of Patanjali, mm-hmm. and for me, the I think as as all my sirs and mentors will say, the first four sutras are enough for the multiple lifetimes. Mm-hmm. Atta Yoga Anushasanam, and now begins Yoga. It becomes it goes to the same concept. ये मोमेंट है ये मोमेंट है एंड नाउ एंड नाउ सो दिस नो प्रीवियस मोमेंट एंड नाउ इट्स लाइक द प्रैक्टिस अनुशासनम द प्रैक्टिस इज नाउ एंड नाउ सो इट्स लाइक द प्रैक्टिस बिफोर अस ओवर या आई हैव टू रीप्रैक्टिस आई हैव टू रीशो अप या द सेकंड वन योग चित्त वृत्ति निरोध हा लाइक कैन ऑफ हाउ योग कैन इज इज द control of all the activities of mind mm-hmm. simplistic definition but so deeply layered mm-hmm. so yeah long story short i've been deeply uh, i'm very very blessed to receive the teachings of yoga sutras the classical techniques mm-hmm. uh, uh, and all the all the different facets of yoga uh, which which i'm learning still now mm-hmm. so i i feel deeply deeply uh, indebted to the tradition that it's almost like a gurukula transmission <laughs> and that is such more powerful yoga as if the teacher is speaking to you mm-hmm. you know we have we have a fifty of us on an online platform mm-hmm. the teachers actually speaking to you mm-hmm. and that makes it uh, yeah that opportunity to to reflect uh, on my purusharthas on my potential on how can i really you kind of know what what how how can i work on the restraining on on the nirodha of the vrittis mm-hmm. and come close to, to my chitta is is i think this uh, possibility mm-hmm. is a blessing in my life absolutely thanks for watching I hope you learned something from this video. Please share your views or questions in comment below. I will reply you very shortly. Please subscribe this channel and get connected with me.